Um, my name's Jenny Marshall. I've been a tour guide for about 17 years. Today we're going to go on the historic tour and we'll wander through the city and end up near the cathedral. Now we start by just talking about this building here because this is where we're meeting. Uh, originally there was a library on the site uh, which was built in the 1960s. Unfortunately in the mid 1990s that burnt to the ground. It was designed by Sir Michael Hopkins and it was finished in two, just before the um, millennium. But we're going to go over now to the City Hall and start the historic tour of the city. Now when the Normans came to England in 1066, the Battle of Hastings, they moved up to Norwich because Norwich was quite an important town in those days and they settled in Norwich. And first of all they moved the marketplace which was near the cathedral there to this area here. So there's been a market here since the, well, since the uh, late 1000s, say 1100. So there's been a marketplace for nearly a thousand years here. Now when the Normans came, um, Norwich grew quite rapidly. First of all they built the castle on the hill behind us. It started its life as a wooden prefabricated castle, a wooden uh, castle which they fitted together on the site. The castle they would have brought across in their boats. And it stayed as a wooden castle for the soldiers for about 25 years. After that time they rebuilt the castle in stone over to the guild hall which is the building over there the flint building this was built in the 1400s to provide offices for the newly elected mayor we were allowed to govern ourselves after the 1400s of course they had nowhere to have all the meetings so they built the guild hall it's built of our only local stone which is the flint stone offices of one of the leading architects in the city at the turn of the 1900s, a gentleman called George Skipper and he, he built his office here. The brick actually comes from Cossie, it's Cossie Red Brick which is a village just outside Norwich. Jarrell's office building on the left hand side here, that was designed by George Skipper and typical of his designs was the different floors are stepped back from one another. Each floor is slightly further back. Jarrells are a very important company in Norwich. Uh, they were very famous for calendar production and various colourful guides of towns all over the country. This whole area had fallen into very bad district, bad repair. It was very slummy, very dirty, and they wanted to demolish the whole street and right down to the river behind here. But luckily it was saved by the casting vote of the mayor of the council and they decided to renovate the street and it's a good job too, really, because it's one of our most photographed streets in the city. 